I've recently used AI to generate a range of blog posts. I've used it to generate some crazy images. And so when the company DeepBrain got in touch and asked me if I'd like to use it to generate an AI presenter, I thought, how could I resist? Let's take this for a spin. But rather than me showing you the platform, I thought I'd let the AI presenter do that for me. Thanks, Mark. AI Studios allows you to generate high quality humans that will present your script for you. There are a range of models to choose from, allowing you to find the best for, for your project. And of course, you can set a background color, such as green, to make it super easy to use the finished output in your own videos. This makes DeepBrain the ideal solution for those wanting to present information about their software platform, but who aren't confident about appearing on camera, or who are concerned their English won't be clear enough for the viewers. Thanks for giving me the opportunity to demonstrate the platform. If you want to learn more, make sure to click Mark's affiliate link in the description below. Mark, why don't you show the awesome viewers the behind the scenes of this project? And so you can see we've got an area where we can edit text so you can create the slides in this platform, add the text. You've got backgrounds, you can change the background color, you can set it as an image, and you can even set a video in the background as well. So you've got down the side, you've got your different AI models and you can use different models on different slides. You can also change it from being the full to sort of webcam view or just voice only. Here in the background, this is an image I took and then I've just popped her over it so she could talk over it. And then on this one, we've got a green screen so you could cut that out and add your own background and your own editing software. So you don't have to do everything in here. And then down here, you've got the script and you've got the audio. So I can do an audio preview. It takes a moment and obviously the more, more text you've got, the longer it takes to synthesize the audio. And if you click on this one, you can see original voice. And, then you've and of got... course, you can set up background color. If we go up here, you can see a range of them and you don't have to generate that text. You can simply press play. With cloud machine learning, your application interprets images, texts. With cloud machine learning, your application interprets With cloud images, machine learning, texts, and so much more. With cloud machine learning, your application interprets images, texts, I, and so much more. I have to say the voices on this are really good. I've tried a few AI voices uh, platforms, and these ones all sound very natural. Now, I think if you can, being further away and smaller, like on this frame, is a little bit better than when they're closer up. If you're going to do that kind of close up, I think maybe that's kind of style where you have them more in a, a selfie type view. So overall, this is a very easy to use platform. You've got different models. You can add text and create the slides. You can have it generate subtitles. Just at a click of a button, it will read what's down here. And there we go, there's subtitles. You've got the images, you've got the backgrounds, you've got the different videos, you've even got different audio built in if you want to use some of the music and you can add some uh, shapes and you can even add some animation to allow things to move around to make this a really engaging presentation. You don't have to start from scratch. You can import an existing PowerPoint presentation or make one for this. And so I've just put together a few very simple slides and I've left this space on the right free for the presenter. And then down the bottom in PowerPoint, you can put in notes. Those are what are going to be read out by the AI presenter. So simply upload your file. It will now convert that into a new project with each PowerPoint slide being a slide within the project. Once it's converted, you can see we've got the slides on the left-hand side, and then you can go ahead and add whichever presenter you want, change the voice, test it out, make sure that you're happy with the text that you've written, make, make any adjustments. And this is where, for example, if you've got a title slide, you're going to want to hide the presenter on this first slide, and you can do that very easily, and then you can have them reappear on all subsequent slides. When you're done, you can export the file as a video and then you can use it however you see fit. You can put it on YouTube, put it on Udemy, put it as part of a course, use it in business, maybe as a, a work training video for people to watch. It's completely up to you. Hello and welcome. Today we're going to talk about change management, what it is and why it's important. 
Change management is a systematic approach to plan, implement, and evaluate organizational change. So you've now seen examples of a couple of the avatars. Which do you think looks best? Would you use this? I'd love to know your thoughts in the comments below. I've given you a list of ways you might want to use this, but can you think of any others? We, we hope, hope you enjoyed, enjoyed the video. video. Click, Click the, the link, link below to try us out. out.